Today will be the first in a series of videos I want to do on putting together this model by Sierra West scale models. Sierra West is uh, owned and run by a man named Brett Gallant and I think his kits look fantastic. I wanted to uh, do a tutorial series on putting one of them together. So this, this one is called Dueling Shacks. You can see there are two different shacks here. Uh, there's different views uh, of the same ones, but uh, one is wooden sided, one will be corrugated metal sided, and let's see what it looks like inside. One of the best things about the kit, I believe, is the instructions. It's a small book uh, with very nicely printed too, but you can see the detailed instructions that go along with it. How to make both the models and all the detail parts. And all the parts you see come with the kit. All these details which really help bring a kit to life. Not only is it extensive, but you can tell probably, hopefully, that the pictures are are easy to see. They're well printed. Often it uh, when you print pictures, photographs, and instructions they're blurry and hard to identify what you might need to see, but these are very well done. In the back he gives recommended um, supplies, the kinds of colors that he uses, but obviously not uh, required, just a recommendation and places to buy them if you need to if you can't find them locally. So instructions you'll find I think very good templates for um, different parts that are depending on the kit no doubt. These are corrugated guides for the sides of the corrugated shack. Other template for the walls of the corrugated shack <clears throat> which are these right here and along with it in here comes the corrugated metal for um, the sides which will of course weather along with everything else. Uh, a base structure for the wooden shack and the wood to go on the sides of that structure um, after we of course weather and take care of these so they look good. Another great feature of his um, kits I showed you on the pictures uh, are all the details that come with it. Rosin and white metal detail parts he has made himself and there's plenty of them but not just plenty of them but uh, they're very well done. There's little parts like hammers, um, a broom, crowbars, bottles, we, you know, wheels and gears, all very well done. Along with some rosin parts, um, lots of barrels and crates which we will c paint, and then tool um, uh, workbenches and toolboxes. The gears in here, I don't know how well you can see them, but detailed gears in, uh, and parts, every one of them. So that helps a lot. The wrench there. That'll help make it look very realistic, which is what we're going for. So I think that's a great kit to, st to start with, and we will move on We'll start building the wooden shack first. <laughs> 